In this lesson, you will learn how to find the unit rate. Let's solve a problem to understand unit rate together. Samantha went to the store to buy maple syrup. She needs to choose between three different brands. The prices of each are as follows. Now what you want to figure out is which brand offers the best deal. Now to find the best deal, you need to find the brand that has the lowest cost per gallon. Now to find this cost per gallon, we're going to calculate something called the unit rate. The unit rate is a ratio that compares two quantities. In the case of this problem, there are two different quantities that we're dealing with. One is the cost and the other is the number of gallons. The second quantity of a unit rate is always one unit. So we want to find the cost for one gallon. Now what we're going to do is use division to find the unit rate. So let's make some space and begin solving this problem. I'm just going to scroll down a bit. Okay. So now we can see in the table that we have brand X, which offers a half of a gallon for $6. Brand Y, you get one gallon for $10. Brand Z, you get 1.25 gallons for $15. Let's begin with brand X. To find the unit rate, we're going to divide the cost by the number of gallons you get for that dollar amount. So let's go X is like this. X is $6 divided by half a gallon. And what you get here is 12. So this means $12 per gallon. All right, I'm just going to abbreviate gal. Now, let's take a look at brand Y. Brand Y is $10 for one gallon, so you would use division again. 10 divided by 1, which is $10 per gallon. And lastly, we can do Z. You get 15 divided by 1.25. And when you do this division, you get $12 per gallon. Now, again, you want to find the best deal. So you want to find the lowest cost per gallon. And after calculating the unit rate, it becomes pretty clear that brand Y is the best because this has the lowest cost per gallon, $10 per gallon versus $12 per gallon of the other two brands. So brand Y is going to be the best choice. In this lesson, you've learned how to calculate the unit rate. Thanks for watching.